As a company that specializes in motion control products, we're obsessed with the details, and motion control is all about focusing on the smallest of details. Since Arc 2's debut, we've released several firmware updates that improve the motion algorithm each time. That being said, it's always a good idea to put your work to the test, and there's no better way to magnify any potential imperfections than to literally magnify the content with a macro lens. In an effort to test the extremes, we look to our friends at Venus Optics to try out their one-of-a-kind Lawa 24mm 2x Macro Probe lens. It's easy to say that we've never used anything like this lens. In some ways, you have to rethink how to film. To start, we made sure our tools fit the story. We created a short film called Into the Details, which you can check out here. In the film, we focus on three individuals whose crafts focus on fine detail. We were then able to push into those details using Rhino Slider and Arc 2. This is where we began to have our first learning lessons with the lens. It loves movement, particularly push-ins and outs. This provides an extremely dynamic parallax that sucks you into the shot. Keep it simple though, and whatever the movement is, stay parallel to your focus plane. This is where Arc 2 comes in especially clutch, as you can keyframe the movement over or through a surface. Filming objects is better than people. As humans, we're incredibly sensitive to perspective renditions of the human body. Seeing things overly distorted can feel disorienting. Sometimes this may be exactly what you're going for, but other times it can be distracting. Remember the importance of light. At a minimum f-stop of f14, this lens needs light to the point where Lawa even has a built-in LED system on the tip of the lens. While this can come in handy in certain shooting scenarios, the preferred way is to add light through other external sources. In order to further enhance the effects of this lens, we contrast the tight macro shots with an extreme wide lens, the Lawa 12mm T2.9 0D lens. This helped us show an overview of the creator's worlds and then dive into the extremes of their crafts. This was a fun experiment and we're proud of the performance of all the gear. As unforgiving as a 2x macro lens can be, especially one that extends nearly 18 inches from the lens mount, Arc 2 held the move steady and smooth. None of these moves were slowed down or used any form of post-stabilization. This helped to speed up the post-editing process as well. What would you shoot with this lens and motion combo? Let us know in the comments below. We'll see you next time.